Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. In a previous video, I showed you this electromagnet that I made using an old electric motor from a fan. For those of you that did not see that video, let me show you. You connect a battery in order to apply a current to the coil and then you have an electromagnet. But once you have this, we can use it to make a couple of extra demonstrations. For example, we can use it to turn it again into an electric motor if we apply electric current AC current, we can make a magnet turn. Here I have a magnet with this axis and I put a couple of tubes so that the magnet can turn freely. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, Consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. We apply AC current with this transformer and then when we bring the magnet close to the core it starts to rotate. The explanation of how it works is very simple. We have here alternating current and that means that we have, for example, a north pole here and a south pole here. But when the current changes direction, then the situation is reversed. Now this is south and this is north and that happens all the time, 60 times per second, which is the frequency of the alternating current. Therefore, imagine that we have north here, therefore the magnet will move so that a south pole is aligned with the north here. And a north here is aligned with the south. But then the AC changes direction and now this is a south, so the magnet turns in order for the north face to be aligned with this. Therefore, as the AC is changing direction, the magnet rotates in order to be aligned with the corresponding field. And, of course, since we have here AC of 60 Hz, the magnet will rotate at 60 revolutions per minute. We can also use our electromagnet in order to demonstrate electromagnetic induction. Let me turn it on and I have here a coil connected to an LED. This was a relay. I am using just the relay coil and it is directly connected to an LED. So when I bring the coil close to the electromagnet, the LED turns on. How it works? Again, it's very simple. 
here we have a varying magnetic field since the current is constantly changing direction the, the magnetic field is moving it is uh, growing and then going to zero 60 times per second and therefore when we bring the coil close the magnetic field cuts all the coil and that induces an electric current in the wire that is the principle of electromagnetic induction and therefore once you have a current in your coil you can use it to turn on the LED of course this only works with AC if we use DC current let me connect the electromagnet to the power supply if you bring the LED close it will not turn on only when you connect or disconnect the current your LED turns on for a moment and this happens because you need a field that is moving therefore when you connect the field is created grows and when you disconnect the field collapses and at that time it cuts the coil and a current is induced but a static field when you have the current connected the field is not moving and therefore no current is induced in your coil okay so there you have it a couple of interesting demonstrations that you can make using the electromagnet i hope you liked this video thanks for your visit and see you in the next one.